Hey there, this is Dr. Bill with Movement First Health and Wellness. I am here today with a serratus press using a band. So you can use this with kind of those handle bands that you can get from Amazon or the store, uh, Target or something, or I have a cook band here. Um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna wrap it around our back, kind of underneath our arms, and I'm gonna use the foam here, but you can use a handle. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna have our elbows out, out straight, and we are reaching as far as we can forward, as, as if we are reaching from under our armpits, kind of along the pathway of the band. What I don't want is for you to round your shoulders forward. And you also shouldn't be trying to set your shoulder blades back. That's a common cue that people get and kind of have in their head. But what we want to do is we're really trying to reach your arms as far as forward as possible using the muscles underneath your armpit here. So again, what you should feel as you do a bunch of these is just a little bit of fatigue from the muscle that wraps along your ribs here from your shoulder blade, that's your serratus anterior. So from there, what we can do is we can kind of go up. Same thing, reaching. So again, I'm not shrugging. I'm reaching forward through my armpits and we can kind of go out as well. trying again to reach from your armpits. Being able to breathe is important, especially because these muscles attach to your ribs. And so if you're bracing your ribs as you're using this muscle, it's not gonna be quite as efficient. So do as many reps and sets as your provider informs you to do and enjoy. Mm -hmm.